Yeah, that's why you don't want to try this at home. Hello and welcome to another episode of Is It a Good Idea to Microwave This? I'm your host, Jory Karam. I'm the crazy truck driver in the sack of Brian yeah, really? See, I don't think trucks can actually do that. Sure they can. Look at yeah, see, that never happens. I've never seen a truck do that. I mean, Speed Racer can do that, but that's... That's all like CGI. And we don't believe in stuff like that. Let's just microwave this truck. It smells like All hands to the deck. Nobody likes roasted nuts. Let's get out of here. Ventilation is key. What are you doing? What the hell? Stopping, stopping. The mask. They do nothing. The tin foil shield of that thing works. Does it still work? You're dumb. 2.6. Is it a good idea to microwave this? Let's find out. Here at the Jory here on the board, Tori 2.6, safety is that door. And that's why we hide behind it, because it's a big door, and it protects our nuts, because nobody likes roasted nuts. Dude, you oh. just crashed. I'm sorry. Uh, I wanted to flip it up like a skateboard, but it's not a skateboard, it's an RC car, donated by Evan Porsico. Let's go on microwave. We also have these fans circulate the air, and as always, the gold star, Melissa. She's beautiful. I love her. You can't have her. Uh oh. No, no, no. Get the parallel. Parallel parking. Oh. Uh oh. Look out, ready? Look out, ready? Oh. There, there we go. go. Uh, you guys kind of left a scuff mark on the side of Melissa there. Do you see that? Just ripped the paint right off. It happens. Or the dirt. I don't know which. Uh, dirt. Definitely dirt. <laughs> Okay, so uh, how long are we going to put that in there? Isn't it weird how these Indy don't have, like, truck things? Indy 500. Which are not involved with trucks in any way. But they're involved with auto racing, so it's close enough. Right, right. Let's do this. Oh, oh. The fake metal on the tires sparkled. Okay, guys. Be honest. When you were kids, you wanted one of those power wheels, right? Power oh. wheels? No, I knew they were slow. You didn't want a power wheel? Riley, didn't you own a power wheel? I'm sure I did. And you're they sure were really you really slow. Yeah, but they were awesome. I wanted a go-kart. <laughs> oh, the step... Oh, oh, oh. Oh, dear. Oh, oh put dear. on the nitrous. What the hell is that? Oh. oh. Oh, that's nice. You know, the objects in that microwave are closer than they appear. Oh, there's a fire. You know, if it was that hard to get it in there... Do you think it'll be that hard to get down? No, it's probably shrinking in size right now because it's melting into one giant lump. Hopefully. Hopefully. It's like watching it burn. Oh. It just it just sunk away. Let's do, let's let's stop this. Alright. Well let's cut it, dudes. <laughs> oh, wow, it came out a lot of The good news it's rear wheel drive. So it'll be going. It's still going. It's still good. Yeah, but the bad news is um, the driver melted into oblivion. Now. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's. Uh, it's like a bicycle, the except pile. the wheels aren't going in parallel directions. So you may be wondering, is it a good idea to microwave an RC car? And I think a unanimous decision is no. RC cars are awesome. I want to drive one right now. Yeah. I mean, do you know those gas ones? Mm -hmm. Oh, those are awesome! Look at sixty miles an hour. Yes. Like a real car. So that's about it for this episode of. Is it a good idea to microwave this? I'm your host, Jory Carrot. And that car is cooked. Ah, the car is cooked. Who donated this? Insert title here. <laughs>